Hello, my name is Michelle Marshall of Patrick Design. I'm honored to be part of this event with so many talented musicians and artists celebrating our Irish culture here in Maine. I spent a great deal of time early in my life immersing myself in Celtic art, lore, and music. It's a strong part of my heritage, and I felt a desire to understand and continue the traditions and the craftsmanship. After searching for classes in in Celtic art design in the 80s and coming up empty-handed, I was given a book by my eldest sister that changed everything for me. It seems like a simple book, but George Bain's publication on Celtic design unlocked the basics I needed to bring my ideas to life. Following in the style and technique, I was able to create new works bringing forward the design and symbolism. I traveled to the UK to see what I could see and be inspired by being in the presence of the carved stones and artifacts across museums, graveyards, and archaeological sites. After a 25-year detour through the real world, I was blessed to be able to return to Maine and finally start my own business and share my designs. So today, I'd like to take you through the steps that go into my jewelry making process. After creating the original line drawing, I import it into my computer and then I can quickly and accurately size it to the various metal bases I offer. I print the designs on a transfer film and hand cut each to fit the base and then move on to the clay stage. I use a two-part clay resin that does not require a kiln to fire, and while it is still wet, I apply the film. At this point, the clay needs to heal for several hours. Once it is dry, I apply a UV resin top coat that seals the final product and gives the piece the look and feel of porcelain. The whole process takes about three days. The designs themselves are a much longer process. My favorite is the one I chose for my business logo, the Celtic Circle of Life. The ancient Celts believed in seven aspects of created life. Plants, insects, reptiles, fish, birds, beasts, and humans. These are all represented in the the design and are bound to each other in the circle representing the journey of life itself through the unending cycle of birth, life, and death. The Triskel, with its three spiraling arms, is also an ancient and important symbol that has come to mean many things through time. Mirroring the idea of the connected cycles of birth, life, and death, it also has been connected to the concepts of past, present, and future, mind, body, and spirit, and was finally adopted post-Christianity to represent the Trinity itself. Each of my designs has a small card that gives a little of the meaning or inspiration of the design based on my understandings of the culture and the incredible work of these ancient artists. I hope you enjoy the celebration of Irish art, culture, and music that is still thriving in our main communities today.